Yeah, so this is actually the kickoff for the American Lung Association uh, to start uh, raising awareness about their event coming up. It's the Louisville Fight for Air Climate. It's here at Lynn Family Stadium where participants are going to be taking more than 5,000 steps around this entire stadium. So it's really cool. We actually have some team members here. Um, so you are on a team, Kaden, the Wolves baseball team. Talk to me about your team and what you guys are going to be doing. We're a 14 new Wolves uh, baseball travel team and we're going to be climbing the steps with a couple of my teammates around the team and support the community. So you guys have done this before. You did it when it was in the PNC Tower. How was that? What was it like doing the climb? The PNC Tower was hard it, and the steps are really steep and it's kind of hard to breathe in the stairwell and that was a good challenge for me. Are you training for this? Are you yeah. okay? How are you guys training? Uh, every Sunday we have practice, and we're always working on baseball and more agility stuff to help us with this. All right. Well, thank you, Caden. The Wolves baseball team is one of the many teams that will be participating. We also have Ty here. Um, he's been taking pictures this morning. What's your team name, and, and how many people are you expecting? Teams bottoms up. We'll have 18 to 20 people, and this will be our ninth year. So. The names changed a little bit along the way, but that was named in offer uh, in honor of Wayne, T Dr. Wayne Tuxen, who uh, is a very valuable member of our family and the community. Listen, tell me what it's like, uh, when, like looking around while you're climbing these steps during the event. What do you see? You know, it's really fun, and people are really inspired to be here, and they're really motivated to be here, and it's for a good cause. I mean, you know, if you can't breathe, not much else matters, and this is really the reason we're doing this. I guess it gives you something to think about when you're having trouble breathing, taking these steps, and, and you're perfectly healthy. Sure. Absolutely. And I'm glad when it's all over, And but it's a great exercise, and it's a great way to get in shape for the uh, coming season. Absolutely. Raises that great awareness and, of course, uh, fundraising for the American Lung Association. Now I'm here with the team captain of the largest team that's participating. She's real pumped about it. Okay, Debbie, tell me that your team name and who's going to be on your team. Uh, Simmons and Steppers, and we will have probably 50 to 60 people. I think we've got about 23, 24 registered so far, and that hasn't been with a hard push. Uh, we have, it's Simmons and Realtors, which has taken on its own life. Uh, within our company and then also we will have uh, one of my great friends who's an amputee who has climbed with us uh, she was the first to register wanted to know when I was going to get the team wow. set up and then um, hopefully our double lung transplant uh, will be climbing with us again uh, and he'll be here to support us I'm hoping he'll be in the in the stands climbing to have such a presence at this event and not only to raise that much money for them what does it mean for you Oh, you know, it's so exciting, uh, you know, and this is the year of uh, years of COVID and if lung uh, health wasn't on everybody's mind, I mean, this is what we're all about. We're raising money. There's a lot of um, good that happens with it and we're all touched with the COVID situation at this point, not to mention there's cancer, COPD, vaping, all the horrible things that are happening out there. And so we want to, you know, make a difference. Absolutely. Well, you can also make a difference by climbing uh, these steps at Lynn Family Stadium on March 11th. You can register for that now. There's also a virtual option um, if that is a better fit for you where you can climb your own way and you can check that out online, guys. <laughs> Listen, that was a PSA for a lung health, if I've ever heard one. She's right? definitely encouraging us to stay active. She's serious. And to stay healthy. So that's a great way to do it and support a good cause at the same time. Alex, thank you.